In previous lessons, we've learned how to use the pen tool. We've learned how to make straight lines like these. We've also learned to make curved lines, like this one. But what I want to show you today is a shortcut that you can use to get a little finer line and possibly to make your work go a little bit faster. So instead of just going here, when you get to this third point, click and hold, and then hold down the Alt key. And what that does is it separates this continuous line and makes it into this curved line. Then what you can do is go to your next point and click on that point, drag it out to where you want it, so you can really, really get that exactly the way you want it. Then hit the Alt key again, point it towards the next point, which in this case is the closing point, and click the closing point. Of course, you can come back and alter that if it's not just right. And you can color it. Oops. Let's go back, change that to my fill. Color it with yellow. And there it is. Now let's move on. Do this one. Click hold. Hold the Alt key. Drag it out. Click, drag it out, hold the Alt key, point it, close it. I'm going to continue to do that around this shape. Click, hold, Alt, direct it. Click, drag it out, hold down the Alt key, point it, close it. Use your direct selection tool to alter it if you need to. Next is this one. Um, what I'll do is I'll start here so that I can show you that particular technique on the corners. Hold, Alt, Point, Click, now there because I had my fill closed. I couldn't really see exactly where my point was. So I'll have to come back and do a little altering of that. And now for the last one, we'll click here. Click here, hold, alt, drag it. Click, hold, pull it out. Now Alt, turn it back, point it. This one we're going to have to alter as well. So direct selection tool, pull this out a little bit. That is pretty good. Now all I have to do with this is color this background, my red color. get rid of the outline and it's done and thanks for watching